What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And for today's video, I will be doing Chapter 24, Problem 1 in the Fundamentals of Physics Textbook, 8th edition by Jiro Walker, Halliday, and Resnick. Chapter 24 is all about electric potential, and in particular, Problem 1 talks about grains that make up Saturn's rings, and you're asked to find how many electrons would one grain have in order to have a potential of negative 400 volts. So we know that V, or potential, is equal to Q, or charge, over 4 pi epsilon sub zero R. And since we need to find charge, we can multiply both sides by 4 pi epsilon sub zero R. So we have Q equals V times 4 pi epsilon sub zero R. And we have all those values, so we can plug them in negative 400 times 4 pi times epsilon sub zero, and our radius is 1 times 10 to the negative 6. And when you plug that into your calculator, you should get a charge of negative 4.45 times 10 to the negative 14th coulombs. And we also know that Q is equal to negative NE, where N is the number of electrons and E is the charge of an electron. And since these two expressions are both equal to Q, we can set them equal to each other and say negative NE is equal to negative 4.45 times 10 to the negative 14th. And we need to solve for N so we can drop the negatives since there's a negative one on either side. And we can also divide by E, so this becomes N equals 4.45 times 10 to the negative 14th divided by E which is equal to 4.45 times 10 to the negative 14th divided by 1.6 times 10 to the negative 19th. And when you plug that into your calculator, you should get 2.8 times 10 to the fifth electrons. So that's it for this problem. If you found this video helpful, please drop a like, leave a comment if you have a question about something I did or an idea for a future video, and lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends about my channel so I can grow and help more of you guys out. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.